The Loose Women host has been at the center of a scathing controversy after it was reported Colleen had diva-like behavior backstage, but the 56-year-old has fiercely denied the claims, retorting that if her behavior had been that poor, her mother would have battered her from beyond the grave. Now Colleen Nolan's boyfriend Michael Jones, who works in a supermarket, has stepped in to defend her, praising her down-to-earth and generous nature. You couldn't meet a lovelier person, he insisted. It comes after Colleen was forced to deny reports of an alleged feud with her Loose Women co-stars after it was reported that panel members Stacey Solomon and Nadia Sawala had refused to be on screen with the presenter. However, Michael, who has said that contemplating marriage with his new beau is inevitable, has been quick to insist that the reports bear no resemblance at all to the woman he knows. It's really frustrating having to see her explain situations that have got nothing to do with her, he dismissed in an interview with OK! Magazine. Michael, who recently posed in a photo shoot for the publication alongside Colleen, elaborated, the annoying thing is you couldn't meet a lovelier person. She's so generous and down to earth. It's just ridiculous. I've been to Loose Women and everybody says the same thing, that she's the nicest person to work with. He is a logistics worker in a supermarket and some have speculated that her choice of a partner, someone with a comparatively modest income and background, would be at odds with any claims of a high and mighty attitude. However, the debate continues, leaving Colleen contemplating the possibility of legal action. It really hurt, Colleen revealed, adding, none of us on Loose Women have ever said we wouldn't work with anyone else. It was just so upsetting. And, it's the only time in seven months I've ever seen Michael not calm. She has received support from not just him, but also her family and fellow stars such as Brenda Edwards and Janet Street Porter. The girls have been so supportive, she explained gratefully. Dot before the previous broadcast of Loose Women, Colleen had taken to Twitter to promise to address the rumors, but caused outrage when she failed to do so. She later explained that she had been advised by lawyers not to say anything publicly at the time. However, she has shared that, I could never be high and mighty because my mother would jump up from her grave and batter me. I can't stand divas of any kind. I've had enough drama in my life, I don't need any more. Colleen has certainly had ample opportunity to encounter divas during her decades-long showbiz career, first beginning when she and her sisters formed a famous group called the Nolans in the 1970s. Meanwhile, her personal life has constantly been blighted by bad news in recent years after two of her sisters, Linda and Anne, received cancer diagnoses within days of each other right at the start of the coronavirus pandemic, and the latest scandal comes as she admitted to feeling sick and mortified after Michael's first ever TV interview. As her beau, who she first met on Tinder, works tirelessly to aid her reputation, Colleen has now made her own feelings clear too, insisting, I get on with all of, my co-hosts. I would never refuse to work with anybody.